welcome, Moon and Star, to Nob Bruntley's Magical Adventures in a fancy tent. Away. And it is a very fancy tent. Um, I, I'll be honest, I don't really remember what we were doing yesterday. Um, Spirit of Peak Star. Oh, I remember that weird quest where I found a cave that was in between two big mountains. Um, and then all of the people that were there gave me their junk, which is just really helpful. So I'm going to go to the house and play, Jed, before we do much else here. And dump it all. Somebody said, and this is a little bit annoying, that for the quest for Sanguine, the Daedric Prince, you need to collect 27 or 28 Sanguine items from Daedric Ruins. We've been picking these up throughout the game, and of course I didn't realize they were anything important at all. Chances are I've sold a lot of them, I'll be honest. Uh, so that quest might be uncompletable unless I track down every friggin' item I've sold to every vendor in the game. So we want to go back to, I assume, our mouth in... Um... So the game's a lot darker for me today. I've, I've got a new monitor recently. It's slightly high refresh rate because this game was making me horribly motion sick. I think I talked about that before. Um, so I, I actually invested into a new monitor, which seems to have helped out a little bit. It is Morrowind. There's only so much you can do for it. But for everything else, it's like really nice and actually kind of kind on my eyes, especially when you're sitting here recording for multiple days in a row. Uh, it, it does help out quite a lot with that. So we want to go to... I mean, we could take the boat from Vivek, right? Over to Telvani lands. Oh, fuck. I'm going completely the wrong way. Bollocks. You think I've got my bearings at this point of the game? Watch this. This is going to be an MLG jump. Right to his front door. Where is his front door? There it is. <gasps> Nailed it. Okay. Uh, Master Adion, I'm here to... Excuse me. Uh, oh, God. Actually, that's a little bit too... It's a little bit too fast, isn't it? Holy shit, with this monitor too, this is this is a strange experience. We won't come across in the video, but holy fuck. Arion, hello. What can I do for you, Mouth? I need some chores. Heard that the blight has infested the Muldan Mull egg mine. Mine is due west of the tower here in Talvos, just a few minutes from here. This is a shortcut if you want to go through the dungeon. The Quamakin has blight disease. Uh, teach me the spell. We've already got it. Um... It is a rather complicated spell. I don't teach you the target of the Cure Blight spell. If you don't understand the principle now, here, you will find this spell much more efficient than most. If you want, you can buy scrolls of Cure Blight from Hedman Abulmawa in Genesis. Thank you, my good man. So we are going to this one. I'm not going to fuck up. We've been given a second chance at <laughs> redeeming ourselves. Uh, this is mine is due west of the tower in Talvos. Okay. So we want to go. Uh, was the tower in Talvos? I assume he means in this direction. Due west of the tower in Talvos. Right. Looking for some sort of Kwama forager somewhere. Something here. What's this? I've not seen a structure like this. What the hell is this? Talvos dungeon. Oh. Ah, there it is. Got it. That's what he meant. Like, you could go through the, the dungeon, I see. Got it. To fight all sorts of... We've got a Kaguti. We've got... Is this one an Ayla? I'm trying to, trying to remember the difference. Yeah, there we go. Between the creatures. Let's get Cure Blight. Um, we have a better Cure Blight, don't we? Blit Vivex Touch is a really, really cheap Cure Blight spell. Let's blitz this as soon as possible. Oh god, are they all Are they all angry? Can I cure you as well? Be gone. Still very angry. Um, I'm going to try and not kill anything in here to make up for the fact that the last mine... The last mine I ruined, didn't I? That was my bad. Get cured. Get cured. Call me Insect Whisperer. Cured. Jewel has been updated. You're welcome. Goodbye. Thank you. Oh, sorry. I forgot about you. There you go. Good as new. And that makes up for the fact that I doomed the town of Genesis a few episodes back. <laughs> um, are you good? Just give him a little, little, little helping hand there. Oh, so I could just go around curing, curing blight on things that aren't even blighted? Weird. That's a bit strange, isn't it? Um, okay. And then, can we rest here? We can. Come in. A, a job well done. Like, for the first time ever. Oh, shit, that was levitate. My bad. For the first time ever, we've actually done a pretty good job there. Now, I'll be honest, on OBS, it's looking very washed out. So, I need you guys to let me know if, if with this, with the new monitor, things are a little bit fucked. Um, because obviously, I can't judge it because the game looks different in the recordings, how it does watching it back. And watching it back on my monitor isn't exactly going to help. Right, so let's go to Master Arion. Have you killed the blight in the Mold Animal Egg Mine? I have. Very good work. As a patron, I suppose you give you some lessons. This book, though, somewhat simplistic, is a good lesson in the school of ulceration. Breathing water. I've already read it. You dick. Okay. Chores, please. I don't mind what you've accomplished in House Talvani. Any student of mine must learn the rudimentary wizard spells. Recall. A spell of flying. A spell of fire damage. Uh, I suppose you... Okay, I've done that. Yes. You've learned the rudimentary spells. I'm proud to be your patron. For your next lesson, please take this book on War of Magic by the legendary Zurin Arctus. 
very big character in the first two Elder Scrolls games. We've already read that one too, you dick. Mouth, uh, chores. One of our fellow Telvani, Milan Faran, is being assaulted by members of House Lalu at Odinaran. It's on Azura's coast, west of the Shrine to Azura, and south of the old Dwemer ruins of Natur Dams. We'll mark these ruins on your map. Go there and speak with Milan Faram, who's under attack by the force of House Lalu. He's probably making his last stand atop his tower. This sounds cool. Um, so we've got uh, somewhere over here, right? Natur Dams. Holilimanan. Hol hol is that where we're trying to go? Um, right. Oh, oh. Diranan, uh, south of the old Dwemer ruins of Natur Dams. Right, so we go there, uh, and then south of that. Apparently, we've been in that area before. Okay, cool. That shouldn't take too long to get to. So take a boat back to, what do you think? Should we go to Talbranora, where old lady uh, crazy, I can't remember her name now, Therana, there we are. Old lady Therana is, and then we'll head out from there. Right, if you'll excuse me, I have a boat to catch, uh, or fall off these, oh, Predicting it probably won't take too long to get there, but when we've made this journey before. What's the quest we were here for? Oh, it's when I was here to find the, um, the Daedric face. Face, right? In the, um... Oh, man, it was in that weird, like, Viking burial chamber. It's quite a cool quest, actually. Oh, it is west of the Shrine of Azura. What am I looking for? West of the Shrine of Azura, south of the Dwemer ruins. So it should be right... Right here, right where we are. But it's quite clearly not. Maybe that's the quest. Maybe it's been destroyed. Uh, I feel like I'm going mad. There's definitely nothing here, is there? Maybe we go back and report that to him. Um, there's like a bigger mushroom in this direction. Let's take a quick look. Yeah, there is fucking nothing here. Maybe his tower's been knocked down. Oh, it's this thing. So it was south of... Oh, we're not looking for a Telvani tower. It's just a fucking... He did say in his tower. He said atop his tower, fighting off sieges, did he not? Probably make him stand at the top of his tower. Are you telling him it's an underground tower? Oh, House Harlow, I guess. Uh, don't think we've been properly introduced. Uh, yep. Okay, then. Let's take a look around. This is very strange. Maybe it's like a Tower of Mundus. Maybe that's what they meant. <laughs> you know, like Red Mountain, uh, Adamantia, Crystal Light Law. I mean, this is the, the the forgotten seventh tower. I don't know how many fucking towers there are. There are infinite towers because they're in your mind. Thank you, Michael Kirkbride. Right, this door open. Care about your weak ass enchantments out here. Ah. So given that these are skeletons, I bet House Lalu didn't make it through that door. Is that what they're trying to say? Okay. I did say it was under siege rather than actually like under assault or under attack. So maybe they were just sitting in there waiting for him to starve. Um. There's a dead one in here. Okay. Right. I feel like these are all summoned skeletons by by the man from Hell's Calvani, aren't they? Ow, you big bitch. Good god. I don't know why. I feel like this weapon is way less accurate from the uh, than the crescent that we had. Okay, there we go. Let's take a look around. I said that's a little bit of a... Uh... <laughs> that is a little bit misleading. I think we can agree. They're like, oh, it's at the top of the tower. And it's actually just all underground. Right, what have we got here? Um, Bone Lord with the Common Soldier. I'll take the Common Soldier. Oh, is that a Daedric Spear? Is it a Daedric Halberd, perhaps? Daedric Spear I've wanted for a while. Oh, it might be a Daedric Staff? If it is, we can put some serious enchantments on something like that. I've been looking for a Daedric Spear for a long time because they have all the, you know, all the enchantment potential that our sword has, but with much more reach. God, it fucking hurts. Wow. And I feel like we'd be able to use it a lot better than the AI would. Daedric Staff. Oh, wow. Okay. I wonder what we can do with that then. Because apparently Ebony... Was it Ebony Staffs? Have some of the highest enchantment points in the game. We might be able to do something really fancy with that. Okay, what have we got down here? Nothing at all. This place is almost like... Uh, it's almost identical to the other place we went to, wasn't it? It is. It is I, I, probably the same map that they've reused. Um, was it for the Mage's Guild quest? Uh, or a companion. Oh, it was in, it was in like Voss or whatever this place was. Doing felt Vass. That was it. It was in Vass. I'm pretty sure where we had to go and kill a necromancer, and escort that lady, and she died like the first few steps into it. Right? Can I have a bit of a heal? Hello, hello. It's truly really a pleasure to see you. Um, are you okay? 
Is Ramasa off-road dead? She is? Excellent. I can get on with my experiments. Since you help me with these metal and hardware, I might be persuaded to share my research my results. Sure. Now go away. I have work to do. I appreciate that. Gonna re read your books. I think he might be a necromancer. Another copy of uh, Nagasta Kavata Kavakis there. You got any rare books I could read? Nothing. Or just the regular old... Ooh. Vampires and Varda fell. Unfortunately, nothing in it. Wait, we were supposed to find a copy of that, weren't we? <laughs> and he is none the wiser. Vampires of Ardenfell Volume 2, I think, was the one that we were specifically trying to find, so that's pretty handy. Um, that was for a Mage Guild quest, was it not? Okay, let's press on. Who's in your dungeon? Has oh, he got a member of House Slalu locked up? Is that why? Let's go see what this is all about. Hello, what do you want? I thought it went badly for us. Take me back to my sister if you can. Uh, you will well, I guess that answers that question, huh? Shit. She, she was dead when I found her. <laughs> what do you mean she's quite clearly been hit by a load of fire spells? Despite your instructions, I do in fact have news from uh, Odiniran. The leader of Hualu in Odiniran has been retired. Perhaps he won't be so hasty to oppose us next time. Thanks to my recent agreements with House Lali, we have a chance of passing a resolution that would overturn the Mage's Guild Monopoly. According to one interpretation of the Armistice, only the Mage's Guild can officially offer spells and training to non-members. So with the House Rotorin Councillors in Alvarun, if you can convince at least three councillors who will have enough support in the Grand Council, I would start with Athrin Sarethi. Seems to be the most open-minded. Was that the guy whose house we robbed to take his fancy clothes? We're not going to, like, turn up in his shoes, are we, that have been missing for a while? Well, that was convenient. I thought I'd try a, um... And now I'm severe intervention, see where we ended up. And we did actually end up in Alvarun. Okay, so councillors. Should we go in here? There is a council hall, but I figured the, the actual councillors themselves are more like to live in here, aren't they? What was the name he gave us again? Um, that's right around. Talk and talk and talk and talk, blah, 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 blah. Um, I don't know who he wanted to speak to in hindsight. Uh, Athrin Sorethi. I'm pretty sure that's the guy we robbed. Morag Tong Guild Hall. Uh, Arabor Manor. Alderun Redoran Council Entrance. Okay, so this is the council building either way. Lorethi Manor. That was it, right? Adarin Lorethi or something like that? And we've got our charm spell, so let's go ahead and equip that one so that we can win him over without having to spend a friggin' fortune. Because our gold stash, we're, we're down to 37k. That enchanting has already taken it out of us. I'm pretty sure he's in this room, like, somewhere in here, right? Let's hear it. Uh, hello, I'm looking for your... That's guard quarters. You're not being there. Um, I vaguely remember we walked past him, did we not? On the way out at one point. Uh, private quarters could be in here. Uh, Tens Nola. Okay, Fancy armor. Uh, Garissa Lorethi. Was it, was it Lorethi or have I made this up? No, it was Sarethi. Bollocks. What was that? <laughs> we can talk to him anyway. Good blast. Um, as a council of House Red around. Ah, yes. Uh, I'd like to talk about the Major Guild Monopoly. What would I have to tell Varney? Get out of my manor. Oh. <laughs> I, I tried. Okay. See, see you later then. Um, well, that didn't go down as planned. Sorethi Manor. This was the guy we robbed, I'm pretty sure. Athrin Sorethi. Blasted. Right. Major's Guild Monopoly. Yes, I see your point. The Major's Guild Monopoly is unfair. I support the resolution to overturn the Major's Guild Monopoly. Perhaps you could convince the other councillors with an appeal to fairness. The only councillor who will ever support this resolution is Archmaster Balvin Venom. You have to convince the councillors if you use an appeal to fairness. House Redoran does not approve that all... Does not approve all House Talvani does, but we are proud of our record of just and fair dealings with the great houses. Right. Um, Bolvin Venin. Okay. Uh, natural leader, born to rule, only wish it was just... A, okay, as well as strong. Right, okay. So why don't we try the council chambers? That seems like a safe place to find the leader of the Redoran Council. <sighs> Politics? Sign up for friggin' politics. Uh, what's in here? Manor destroys. Oh, it's the th three doors into the same building, isn't it? Hello. Hello. Namida. Something not right about you. Uh. Maybe you should go. What a fucking offensive thing to say. Oh, we haven't got like a disease, have we? No, we're fine. Um, Red Run Council Hall or Red Run Council Hall. It's got to be in here. Oh, this place is massive. It's gonna take me hours to find him. Uh. Let's hear it. You know who I'm after. More, v v more brain. To, to Vesu Bella Smith. I actually wanted to go see a Smith about um, gear repairs. Oof. My gold. Uh, what have you got? Is there anything interesting? We got repair prongs, hammers. Grandmaster armor hammers. Wow. 
Those are always worth getting, aren't they, rather than Let's paying for. I should have just bought those instead. Um, and Council Hall, okay. I don't remember the guy's name I was looking for. I'll be, I'll be honest with you. Malpanix Bal... Oh, wow. Okay, what do you sell, then? Barter. Everything. Absolutely everything. Exquisite. He sells exquisite gear. Could have just bought it from here rather than stealing it from the other guy. Oh, the only council who would never support this resolution is Archmaster Bolvin Venom. Right. Well, that was lucky that I double-checked what his bloody name was. Right. Okay. Um, I don't know who we... Who we can go and speak to here. Okay, well, let's leave this place then. We're looking for councillors that aren't him. Uh, are you a counsellor? So False incarnate, agent of the Emperor, outlaw, unbeliever, house everyone knows how to deal with outlanders like you. Uh, what about supporting me in stopping the Mage's Guild? Uh, oh, she doesn't fit with me. Is she a member of the temple? Ah, almost certainly. Okay. Sorry, bye. Mistress Brara, she was another one in the council chamber. Um, I'm going to give you some gold. And I'm going to hit you with a appeal to fairness. I understand and agree. The law is unfair and must be changed. You have my support. Wow, that was easy. Shit, I didn't even give her a thousand gold. That was just like the, the, the pocket change I had lying around, huh? Right, Galsa Gindu? Uh, you wouldn't be a... Uh, oh. God, they really don't like me, do they? Ever since we became the Nereverine, or started becoming the Nereverine. I feel like we should probably finish that quest line, otherwise no one's going to speak to us, are they? Uh, to yeah, so. not me either. Okay. Let's go and check out the other manners. Now that I know it's everybody but the Arch... The Archmaster or whatever. What about Gulls Clevereau? Doesn't like me either. Oh, Come God. On. Okay, which is the way out, then? Fuck this. Get nowhere here. Um, right around council entrance. Here? Okay, yes. Okay. And then we go back up through the triple Speak doors. Traveler. So let's go to the Speak various traveler. manors then. And see if they'll... Ooh. Ooh. Oh, God. Okay. Timing's everything here. Just see if they'll speak to us. Um, we've got the Arabra Manor. Uh, Ethes okay. Evos. No, he won't speak to me. We're looking for somebody... What was their name again? Um, somebody Arab Araba, I assume. Arab guard quarters, Arab private quarters. What are these fucking guards playing at? <laughs> you just wander around freely anyway, they don't give a shit. Okay, Gandosa. No, she's not the right person to speak to. Okay. Let's try in here. Probably looking for the master bedroom, right? Ah! You look like the guy in charge, judging by speak those shoulder traveler. pads. Uh, persuasion, 100 gold, build a furnace. Because the events, it's similar necessarily to put aside the childish notions of allies and enemies and focus instead on the debate in which propositions based only upon their merits. It's indeed one of those times. Uh, I shall therefore support the revocation of the Major Guild Monopoly, lest history look upon my actions with a baleful eye and claim that I allowed expediency to overwhelm principle. That's two of them. Well, we've got three of them now, though, right? Um. Yeah. So we've got the first guy. Then we've got Mistress Morvane. Minor... Mina, I guess, maybe his name is. Uh, Arabar. Okay. Let's check some of the other buildings. I can fucking remember the way out. How do we get in here again? Wooden door? Oh, God, no, this is the wrong way. Uh, entrance. No, it was the right way. God, what a mess. There's so much room. Uh, okay, this way then. So we'll check on Morag Tong. Maybe not. Venom Manor. Okay. Ah, oh, this was definitely the place I robbed. I remember it well. Wealth beyond. Uh,. Guard quarters. We've got a Rethi. We've got Alva. Private quarters. Here we are. Oh, he's down here, right? I remember. Somewhere in this room. Because I said, ah, oh, we couldn't find the shirt. And then it turned out the dude was actually wearing the shirt himself. If I can find him. Right wing? Sure, why not? I'm sure I made a hilarious joke about that last time. Uh, is he in here? Right wing tends to obviously not be against... Monopolies. Oh, God. It's too obvious. Um, Ulez. Oh, God. This place is fucking huge again. Tell me where your... Tell me where your master is. Private quarters. Shit. Oh, this might take me a while. Bear with me. Ah, there he is. Bolin Venom. Uh, let's just have some important business. I suggest you leave. How about... How's a thousand gold, huh? How's two thousand gold for important business, brother? Appeal to fairness. Zora's is undeniably fair. You'll tell Viney lies. Do not sway me. Another thousand. Appeal to fairness. Fuck. Uh... Never support a lot. Oh, what a bitch. Okay. 2,000 gold well spent there. And about 40 minutes spent looking for him amid this bloody labyrinth of a house. Just a load of empty rooms. You could downsize your property massively, my friend. Oh, shit. Ah. Hlaren Ramaran. Yes. Gold for you. Appeal to fairness. Words convince me. It's rare I agree with the Talvani proposal. I will agree to this. Boom. Uh. Are we, are we good? Oh, no. And how many do we have to convince again? Maybe that's enough. I will go and speak to the guy who gave us the quest. Not originally, but the guy he sent 
sent us to speak to. So someone Sorethi? I spoke to him. Uh, he basically said the same thing. Uh... Lorethi Manor, I don't think we ever came back to, did we? We went straight to the council hall. I've got better things to do, so yes, I'm well aware. Everybody in this town is saying that to my poor boy over and over and over again. Lorethi Private Quarters. Okay, ah, yes. Uh, persuasion. 100 gold. Appeal to fairness. Show that you understand it, so I support this resolution. I suppose we can talk. I'm pretty sure that's everybody, right? I've gone into every building and spoken to someone about it, besides the... Arch Magister. Um, okay, I just want to double check. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six manners. One's an entrance. One, two, three, five, six manners. Right, and then the council hall. And then one person said no. Okay, what do I do now then? Give the support to write the Monopoly of the Mages Guild. Arion, Morvrain, Arabar, Ramaran, Lorethi. Uh, bear in mind that one, I'm including the other guy. Um,. Right. Yeah, that's basically all there is to it right now. So I took a silt strider up to Margan, seeing if there was a faster way get to get back, seeing as it's on the other side. I want to see the middle of the volcano, to be honest with you. And honestly, I figured this was probably quicker than trying to track down a bloody boat. Um, Let's go and take a look at the very, very top of the Red Mountain, then. Go on a little, go on a little tourist... Oh, for fuck's sake, really. Uh, <laughs> go on a little tourist journey through the Ashlands. We're probably about the only person in Vardenfell that can even do this. Oh, come on. What the hell's going on with this spell? We're getting stuck on the geometry of the bloody sides of the mountain. Freaking game can't handle our jumps. Right. Try again. And leap. Close enough. That'll do. That'll do. That's fine. Not bad. I'm worried that we might uncover something horrible right at the top of this mountain. Um, we're not really, not really supposed to be here. It's a fucking big old, old volcano after all. Where's the actual caldera? Oh, this is it. Oh, here's the center of the volcano. Right, thought it was. Uh. Oh, nice. This is this is nice. Big old big old Dwemery ruin. Obviously, we won't go in there. I have a feeling those are things that we're not supposed to see quite yet. Mate, I was expecting something a little more impressive. Don't tell Tegoth I said that. Right, so we want to go back in back in this direction. That was a bit too much of a detour, to be honest. Right, let's give it a give it a jump. Okay, bit dangerous. Wow, look at the sky though. You see where they got the inspiration for the Oblivion Gates from, huh? Set up camp for the night. There we are. Lovely. What a what a fine journey. What a lovely trip. Cross Red Mountain. <laughs> There's so many Dwemer ruins up here. I think I've probably seen about three or four during this little trip over here. And I assume each one is probably a, a main part part of the main quest anyway. So we won't go into any now, but man. It's been a lot of Dwemer ruin diving. Oh god. That's a long way down. Okay. Slow fall seems to be working fine. Nothing to worry about. I think this is where they intended the game to be played. I mean, I guess... I guess so. They would have probably patched it out long before now, right? If they had a problem with you leaping through the air from the top of Red Mountain. <laughs> right, where are we then? Zainab Camp. Oh, we're actually very, very close. You are never going to believe where I've been. We've ended it. There you go. Ar Arion's Dominator. Oh dear, that doesn't sound like a very good reward. So in the Telvani Trouble, I don't normally interfere with these maps, but I've taken an interest in this, so I need someone to stop the Red Run attack on Father Zanders in Shishi. Several Red Run have inf infiltrated Shishi, and the Telvani Father Zanders have gone into hiding. Shishi is a Velofi Tower in the middle of Fo... Fo... Yada Bani Dad. Oh god. Northwest of Margan. Not back to Margan. <laughs> <laughs> you son of a bitch. Look for a skull on the desk. It opens the door to a secret storage. Brother, do you know where I just came from? Okay, Margan. Uh, she, she, we found Shishi before, didn't we? Uh, Falothi Tower in the middle of the Foyanda Bani Dad. Northwest of Margan. Leave Margan. Go east past the Silt Strider. Follow the Foyanda north and west. East past the Silt Strider. Okay. East past the, east past the fucking Silt Strider. What the hell are you talking about? East past the Silt Strider. That's this way. Okay. Um, follow the Fyander north and west. Okay, so north, west. This way. I think. Okay. Um, so, so, Chishi, north and west. Um, go east past Silt Strider. Follow the Fyander north and west. If you cannot find Father Zanders, look for a skull on his desk. Right. So, we're looking for a Velothi Tower... Somewhere around here? Ah, that's gotta be it, right? Oh, that one. Oh, I don't know. Let's go and have a look. 
Excuse me, bandits. We haven't got time for your shit anymore. Could be that one, but there was actually a Velothi Tower in that direction. Um, I, th I think that those are actually called Dunmer Strongholds. At least they were on the wiki last time I had a look at what they actually were. Be gone. Oh, God, all these fucking monsters. Get out of here. Right. She, she. This is it. Oh. Oh, that's not a good sign. Skull on a desk. Oh, God, they're all dead. Um, and here we go. Skull on a desk. Was it me that killed them all? I might have. Oh. Oh, right around. Right around. I was like, what the hell is there? Someone in bone mold here. But of course, it's, it's right around armor, isn't it? Bone mold. Um, class storm shot. 17,000. You shouldn't have. Thank you. Okay. Careful. Your wounds are great. I mean, they aren't. They aren't, but I appreciate the effort. See, this is why I'm thinking that Katana is better than the... The sword. Uh, better than the crescent, I should say. Just because we can back off so fast that the enemies can't hit us anyway. Uh, as instructed, party of five entered the Velofty Tower of Shishi. Five Tavani sorcerers found in the towers now as we've suffered heavy, heavy losses. Two. They've suffered two losses. That's what they're getting at. Okay. Um, dead. Dead. Not the guys that we're after, though. Pig Chieftain. Adrian Daedra. Blasphemous Revenant. Cyrodiilic Brandy. That's mine. Uh, skull on a desk. Uh, what did that do? <laughs> I don't know. Could have done absolutely anything. Okay. Nakamas' formula in the reflection on cult worship. Um. But it's, ah, trap door to Shishi. Hello. Think we've been introduced. I'm Father Sanders. How can I help? Uh, I'm here about your castle. You killed Barama Celis. Excellent. I can have the other reverence on my own. I should tell Master Arion that you assisted me. You find that these books interesting. Thank you. Luna, Lorcan, and a hypothetical treachery. Uh, could you imagine if they gave you that as a quest reward in Skyrim rather than just plus ten fuck off acts of mighty lightning dragon breath? People would riot. Okay. Let's go to Arion again. Oh my god. <laughs> Line up, boys. Holy shit. That's a lot of cliff races. Wow. Jesus, Jubby's He's going to have nothing left to do by the time we're finished here. What a damn mess. Look at that. Okay. Um, right, where to then? We've got to go back to the... T I genuinely think after all that time and effort, trying to get back there last time probably is just easier to see the intervention and take a boat all the way around the south of the island. I should have really put a mark and recall there, shouldn't I? Maybe I'll do that. Although we might be close to being finished with the quest. I think it'd be better to have a recall up in the uh, Shilaku camp. Because that's a little bit harder to get to than here. Which is just a boat ride over. Home sweet... With shit. Home... Excuse me. Home sweet home. Right. Where is he then? Arian. Uh, I have freed Shishi. Now, let's talk about chores. Do not have any chores that I... You've done all I expect for mouse. Find out what you need for in advancement. You're more than qualified for spell right. Uh, advancement again. Qualified for wizard, but you must first build a stronghold. For the matter regarding your tower, you should speak to Lunella Hyalran at the Talvani Council House in Sadrath Mora. This is what all of today has been for. To get ourselves a stronghold. Right. Okay. Um, Sadrath Mora. Quickest way there. Um, back to Voss. Take the boat. South to Sadrath Mora. And then we'll speak to the lady in the, in the, in the tower. I vaguely remember who he's talking about. And then we're good. What if that person drowned who fell off the docks? Uh, travel to Sadrath Mora. Here we are. We keep wanting to go to the council hall, right? So that's this one. I believe. I don't remember. <laughs> no, it doesn't take long like, to bounce around there, does it? Right, who was it we speak to again? I don't remember. Should have already written that one down. My bad. Okay. Hello. Uh, me about my fucking what? stronghold, chief. I mean, what brings you here, spell, right? Uh, my stronghold. Speak to Lunella Claren. I assume it's none of you guys, then. Lunella Claren. None of these ones. Okay. Lunella Claren. This was the dungeon, if I'm not mistaken. So this is probably all a waste of time. Tavani Council Chambers. Ah. This could be it, actually. Look at this place. is huge. Uh. Lunella Helen. Helen. No. With virtue, Outlander. None of these guys. Uh. Is that you, Lunella? Fuck. Yes. Hello. Uh. How do you do? What's this one? Tavani Council House Hermitage. Oh, we've seen this before. This is quite cool, but not really what we're after. Um, oh, it might be, I guess. Hermitage? They could be a hermit right down deep in the bowels. Hello. 
Lunella Laren. I am here to discuss my stronghold. Build a tower of your own spell, right? First, you must acquire a construction contract from Duke Vedam Dren. Bring me two strong souls for the foundation of your stronghold. Okay. Uh, no, I don't. Duke Dren. Uh, it's been too quickly. We've allowed our young and ambitious building an authorized base across the Vardenfels. We've only trouble with the Grand Council. You make sure the stronghold official. Venom Dren. Um, oh, in Ebonheart. In Ebonheart. Right, right. I was going to say, there was a Duke Dren in... Next to Vivek that we robbed for his Daedric Greaves that we're still wearing to this day. So I feel like if it's him, we're in for a little bit of, uh... <laughs> we're in for a little bit of, uh, a problem trying to get this tower approved. Right, and it was back round... Is there any wonder I got motion sick playing this freaking game with all of that stuff going on? Can we just wait to Vivek? I guess we'll take the mage train. Oh, wait, we've got an Ebonheart. Take the boat. What are you doing? Yeah, a lot faster. I assume we can take a boat straight to Ebonheart, right? Doesn't really matter either way. It's only a jump across from Vivek, isn't it? Hello. Uh, no one drives that boat. It's just a spare boat they have around. Unless they've drowned as well. Right, you take me to... Did you go straight to Ebonheart? <gasps> he does. Right, Duke Dren. This is fancy. I like that. Was this added all as DLC? What say you? I don't remember it the first time I played Morrowind. Uh, what have we got in here? South Warehouse. This is, yeah, okay, I just wanted to double check. Duke Dren. I How do can I help? Enjoy a <laughs> Look at that little guy with his pointy hat. Right. Uh, Duke's Manor? Six fishes. That's not what we're already after, is it? Main castle, I guess? This place is huge as well. Duke Dren? Yes. Pelis Mauritius. Mat Matthias, I remember you. Do we ever pick up that ebony I dropped on the floor? It's hard to remember. Jonas Maximus. Fantastic name. Right, it's got to be in here then. Uh, Duke Dren. Duke Dren. Hlalu. Drenim. Uh, Con Concian. Fuck. This could take me a while. Hang on. Duke oh, Vedam Dren. Let's line his pop pockets. Not that obviously he needs it. Uh... Construction contract. I know your deeds, Nerevarine. Oh, he's calling us Nerevarine. He doesn't really care. Grant you a construction contract. Here, take it. Let's take it to my gratitude for what you've done with my people. We're not Nerevarine. Uh, not yet, anyway. Thank you. Construction contract added to your inventory. Then we need two strong souls. Now, I assume we probably want to bank Azura Star at this point, right? Otherwise, they might accidentally take that as one of the two souls necessary. The strong souls, we can trap uh, soul... Oh, no, we can't, can we? Grand Soul Gem, we wouldn't be able to trap a Golden Saint in. We can summon a Hunger... That would probably work. I've just about found my new favorite game in Morrowind. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine if this woman ever goes home? Bear in mind, we never actually got this house the proper way with the quest. She just comes back and she sees, honestly, probably about a million drakes worth of crap just on the floor. Right, so Soul Gems Grand. We do have five. Um, so I guess we'll just go ahead and summon and soul trap a monster of some description. Um, I don't really know what counts for Grand Soul. Uh, whatever is the hardest to summon, right? So, like a, like a hunger would be pretty tricky. Skeletal minion. It's 39, really? Oh. Uh, golden. Oh, that's the cost. Sorry, my bad. Um, 87 then. Uh, 156 on Wing Twilight. Okay, let's go Wing Twilight then. Bollocks. Who'd have thought? Right, okay. Um, fortunately, this is going to be the same story as the Saint. This shouldn't take too many attempts, though, bearing in mind that, uh, this one had, like, a 20, 23% chance of success, was it? Hey, there we go. Okay. And let's take a bit of a sippy. And then soul trap. Get roasted. And slay. Right. Okay, hopefully that counts. 60,000, wing twilight. That's gotta be it, right? Done. Okay, I had to come to the mage go to get another potion there, but that is two grand soul gems and a construction contract. Hopefully that's everything we need for this bloody tower. Let's go ahead and quickly take a boat from... Yeah, I was at the Mage's Guild, obviously, so that we could get access to some restoration potions for the, for the Soul Trap. Because summoning the Winged Twilight used up all our magicka. This should be it. I'm hoping this is everything we need to get ourselves a nice little stronghold. And then we'll probably leave the tour for tomorrow. Um, enjoy the fruits of our labor then, because this has gone on for a hell of a long time. Right, travel to... What am I looking for? Uh, Talbranora. Then we want to take you to... No, 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 Talbranora is where we want to be, right? No, 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 we want to be Sadrith Mora first. It was just in the Mage's Guild. I, don't ask me why I didn't just go from there. That'd be far too straightforward. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Don't panic. Okay, there we are. Oh, careful. Still carrying that form of momentum. We go all the way down motion sickness corridor. Here we go. <laughs> what a what a fun... What a fun piece of architecture. They've really, really done a great job with the thumbnail. Back into the hermitage. 
Uh, we jump down here. And there she is. Hello, Stronghold. Yes. We use these cells to begin the construction of your Stronghold. Stronghold, your stronghold will begin soon. How soon? 24 hours soon? How about now? Stronghold. Begin soon. Um. What do you mean? Should we give the orders to begin construction? Can I help with that? Maybe, trust it was not too difficult. No, it was not. Um. Can I help you with it, with it at all? Or are we just... Well, I guess that's it. Okay. Now we wait and we hope that when tomorrow comes, the tower will be built. Oh, there's obviously treasure down there, isn't there? The tower will be built and we'll have somewhere to store all of our stuff in a nice, effective way. Rather than building a shit tower on the floor in... <laughs> in Blade Jet, which has never been really convenient anyway.